it's your girl G here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm super duper excited to be introducing Story Time with Jay. And today the story is about the time I ran into a house with a car and almost killed me, myself, and others, and even children, you guys. Even children. Now since I'm thinking about it, what if I would have like killed somebody? I would have go to jail for manslaughter. And I honestly just can't see myself being in jail because I would have been somebody's cat. I would have been somebody's cat doing with dirt. I just can't think about it. No, no, no. Let's just get right into the story. So one day I came home from cheerleading practice. It was around 545 and I was getting into the shower. So as I'm in the shower, you know, I hear some of my friends in the house. So I'm like, okay, cool. They came over to chill and talk. So, you know, it took me about 30 minutes to take a shower. As I got out the shower, everybody was outside and they were outside because they were smoking. So I'm like, okay, what you doing? Like, literally, what are you doing? But they were all high and everything. So I'm like, um, Logan, can I use your car? So everybody was like, Jimmy on, you cannot drive. You cannot drive. I'm like, hey, like, why you hate me? Because he might let me drive, like, chill. So everybody was like, no, she cannot drive, Logan. Do not give her the key. She cannot drive. I'm like, Logan, yes, I can drive. Like, I can drive. So, you know, he gave me the keys, right? So we got into the car, and I'm backing out of the house, and I felt like I was driving extremely good, extremely, extremely good. Like, you know, everything was smooth. Until I crossed the street, and I was entering the other side of the neighborhood, and I seen this big curve i'm like oh my god i don't know how to turn like that good like i might turn too wide or something as i'm making that turn i did my turn extremely too wide and they had like this brick um brick thing on the side of the work road and like we drove on top of the brick onto the grass and crashed into the house hitting the bricks I'm like, oh my God. And as we hit the bricks, all I remember is my head flying back and my nose just going into the steering wheel. I was full of blood and everything. My nose was bust open. I'm like, oh my God, what just happened? So we were both freaking out. So I'm like, oh my God, we ran into a house. We're going to go to jail. I'm like, oh crud. So he was like, what should we do? I'm like, uh-uh, we gotta go. So, you know, we, like, drove off. So, it was kind of like a hit and run. But we didn't think that nobody, like, would have take his license plate number or anything. But little did we know, they took his license plate number and they had a camera right outside their house. So, they seen us crash into their house and they seen our faces. I'm like, oh, my God. What are we going to do? So he drove back to my house and he got out the car and like everybody was that stayed was in the house and they were all in the, li all in the living room. So I walked into the house and my nose was bleeding so everybody was like, Jimmy on, what happened, what happened? I'm like, we just got in a car accident. So they're thinking it was like, you know, something minor or something. But they didn't know we ran into a house. So Logan, Logan came inside the house horrified, just cursing, this like this very mad he was like oh my god we hit a house we hit a house like what i'm gonna do what i'm gonna do so he went back home so you know i had to think of a plan because my mama was coming home and everything and my nose was buzzed so i was like hey jamie why like why don't you spray some febreze in the air or something because we had a marble floor so i'm thinking you know it's gonna be slippery like five minutes after i got home my mama pulled up so I was on the ground faking like I fell. So right when she opened the door, I was right, I was laying on the floor right outside the door pretending like I fell. So she was like, Jamie, um, what happened to your nose? I was like, well, Jamie was spraying some Febreze and I ran and I uh, slipped and I hit my nose. So she was like, okay, she started to believe me. <sighs> all I know is I went into the back room and all you heard was boom, 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 boom on the door I'm like oh crud that's the police yo like the police came to my house like about four cop cars came and they're like is your daughter Jamie on here and she was like yes what did she do 
he was like, he, she didn't tell you what she did. She ran to a house. She did a hit and run. So I'm thinking I'm going to jail. So he came into the house. They came to talk to me. They asked what happened with my side of the story. So he asked if I had a license. And I was like, no. And he asked if the person I was driving with had a license. And I was like, yeah, you know, he's of age. And he had a license and everything. So after that, they like read me my rights and stuff. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm about to go to jail. I'm about to go to jail. But I did not go to jail, you guys. They gave me um a ticket, a ticket of $500 I had to pay. And I had to pay for the lady's house and everything. I'm like, oh my God. Like, oh my God, what did I do? And he told me how they watched the video and how I almost killed somebody. I'm like, what? I almost killed somebody. They were like, yes, if the children would never, like, ran, you would have killed them and you would have went to jail. I'm like, oh my God, this is crazy, yo. This is real life crazy. So I'm like, I don't know what I'm going to do, you know? So after that, the cops left from my house, and my mom was extremely pissed. She was, like, so mad with me. She was like, why in the hell are you driving anyways? You don't even have a license. So after that, we had a court date probably about two months after that. So the judge, she made me go to driving school and everything, and she was like, next time I decide to drive without a license, I will be going to jail. I'm like, oh, my God, this is crazy. Crazy, yo, this is real life crazy. I was trying to grow up before my time, and if I would have hit somebody, I would have been in jail right now, and the family would have lost somebody good, and I would have, my family would have also lost somebody good, you know? I would have been in jail, and they would have been, you know, buried somewhere. So that's why I was, ex like, I was extremely blessed God was with me at that time. But, honestly, I really advise everyone not to grow up before your time if you're 16 14 15 and you're itching to drive please 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 practice or go into somebody's driving school and do not get on the road until you have your driver's license until you know how to drive because a simple mistake can just end up deadly so thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoy please like comment and subscribe i'll see you soon goodbye j babies